Hi you guys, so today I will be sharing with you how I created my own vanity lights for my makeup table. As most of you know, I've been revamping my bedroom and DIY projects have become my fave. So for this DIY project, you will need a light bar or bath bar, basically a vanity bar that holds round light bulbs, scissors, wire connectors, an extension cord or two, glow bulbs in either soft white or crystal clear, and a wireless wall switch. There are some other optional items you can get. You can hang up your vanity using push pins, nails, or command strips. You can spray paint your vanities any color you want to match your room, and outlet adapters will allow you to add multiple vanities to your makeup area. So basically here I'm just taking the bath a vanity bar out of the box and you want to be careful that you don't throw any pieces away because this is where your wire connectors will be packaged at so now I'm taking off these little knobs that go around the light bulb base this is what holds the front of the bath bar and the back of the bath bar together and now I'm just taking the copper wire and unraveling it so I can pull the front away from the back. In addition to the copper wire, there will also be two other wires, a white wire and a black wire. You can go ahead and remove the tips off of these wires and set the whole bath bar to the side. Now you just want to go ahead and grab your extension cord and cut off the receiving end of the extension cord. And after that, you want to take your scissors and cut down the center of the extension cord down the kind of line of demarcation and pull apart the two separate pieces of extension cord. So now with your scissors, you want to make a small indent on both ends of your now split extension cord. This will kind of just break the barrier of the external covering so that you can expose your wires without damaging them. After this, you want to go ahead and identify which wire goes to which. So the smoother side of the extension cord is the black side and the rougher side with the ridges is the white side that goes to the white wire. So ridges goes to white, smooth goes to black, and twist the wires together. So now take your wire connectors and just place them over your wire so that they don't do any touching and cause a fire or sparks or anything like that. Ain't nobody got time for a fire. Once that's good, you want to take your copper wire or your ground wire and just wrap it around the numerous wires just to hold them together. And then you want to go ahead and just start reassembling your bath slash vanity bar. So now it's time for the fun part. You get to actually test out your bath bar to see if it works as a vanity light. And I'm basically just screwing in these soft white globe lights. This was my first time attempting to do this when I was filming. So this is a very, very doable DIY project. And unfortunately, one of the bulbs did just go out randomly. So yeah, I had to go to Home Depot and exchange the stupid thing. So attempt number two, I got the crystal clear glow bulbs and I hope that they would just look a little bit better than those just soft white ones. I feel like this goes with the silver more. And I was also hoping that the last set of bulbs I had were just really faulty and that it had nothing to do with my wiring being jacked up. So I'm about to test it again and it works. Like I said, this was my very first attempt and I got it pretty much on the first time. So I was just uber excited about that. So this next part is completely optional. This is the wireless remote and you basically just plug in your extension cord into this, plug it into the wall like a regular outlet 
and it comes with a remote control that looks like a light switch so you can stick it on your wall and click it and the lights come on with a flick of a switch. So now as you can see I did another set of lights and put them on either side of my mirror and basically you can just hang them with whatever you want. I use push pins and with a flick of a switch again you can see that my lights cut on. I did run the two extension cords together into one external adapter and that's how I got the little switch to work. So here's a close up of my vanity lights. They are so, so pretty and I love them and I really feel that they just complete my makeup space. Thanks for watching this video. If you're gonna try this at home, definitely give me a thumbs up. If you would like to see a room tour or a makeup table tour, just leave it in the comments down below and make sure you're subscribed to my channel because I have a lot more DIY projects coming your way.